Hello, I'll talk about IQ and Mr. Bean. So, the average IQ in the world is 100. So, how do 100 IQ people view 140 IQ people? They view them as a genius. So, 40, 40 points higher IQ. Okay, so how do 140 IQ people view 180? They view them as a genius. But how do 100 IQ people view 180 IQ people? They view them as retards. <laughs> so you want to Google Mr. Bean IQ and you will see he has 178 IQ. Okay, who knew? Normal people with 100 IQ, they view 180 IQ people as Mr. Bean. Isn't that strange? That's really strange. Wow. So, same thing in life about everything. If, if you, if anyone doesn't understand something, they're gonna see that as stupid. That's what people see, something they don't understand. That it is stupid. Like these trees here. People think trees are stupid. But trees are really intelligent. It's just that the humans don't understand another species. That's, that's, the, that's the difference here. That's, people who don't understand something think of it as dumb. But people who are really close to the same intelligence level, they can clearly understand something with the higher IQ level. But if, it, if the IQ level is way too far, there's a big gap here in the middle, and there comes that kind of a incompatibility between those two people that they don't really they don't understand each other. So that is why people view Mr. Bean as a retard because they don't understand what he is doing. Okay, so yeah, so that was an example here, and you know the uh, Rowan Rowan Atkinson who plays Mr. Bean. He has 178 IQ. So, people just, everyone are just uh, uh, surprised to find that. With people I talk to, they have just no, they have no idea he has so high IQ. Because they just, they just don't understand. They don't understand him. Okay. So... I don't understand the dogs, That's, that doesn't mean that they are dumb. I don't understand the plants fully, nobody nobody understands the plants fully. That doesn't mean that plants are dumb. They just are at a different uh, existence, where they live in a different way. They don't need to go out to hunt, they just sit there, get the sun, get the rain. I think that is more intelligent. That you don't have to go through all the trouble of going around to hunt for food when you can just let the food come to you. I think that is really intelligent. You can just stay there and wait. That is that is pure intelligence. And that is why plants have lived the longest life. Because they are the most intelligent species on the planet. The most intelligent species live the longest and take care of the planet. And the dumbest species destroy the planet and don't uh, exist for long. Okay, I will go now. I will see you next time. Goodbye.